here today to discuss and uh, preview a bold addition to the 2010-11 op uh, season for the Lancaster Performing Arts Center. And I am pleased to introduce our Vice Mayor, Mr. Ron Smith. You know, this, this looks like it's just going to be an amazing show. And, uh, you know, I, I think of years ago, you know, there was a show, Moomenshans, that was similar. This is probably like 10 times better. And it's going to be just, uh, we got, we were lucky to be able to get the show. And it's sponsored by Waste Management, who I'll be introducing somebody today. But we're going to see a video clip right now. And in the show, you have some talented dancers and, and actors that breathe life into recycled aluminum, uh, industrial materials to tell a story of a young machine determined to reunite with its parents during its travels through a futuristic world ruled by a bizarre technology. It finds an adventure, excitement, and even a human friend who does whatever it takes to get back home to One Piece. So let's roll the clip. You know, I mean, who better to, you know, sponsor this show than Waste Management, who is really big into going green and recycling. And uh, Waste Management is the perfect sponsor for this, and so I can talk about some of their stuff, but I'd like to introduce uh, Julianne Fulton instead, and she'll talk about Waste Management's part. And you know, um, it says I'm going to talk for three minutes, but that probably won't be the case. I'm going to keep it nice and quick. Waste Management is proud to sponsor and be a part of the Lancaster Performing Arts Center Aluminum Show. We're happy to also support the Arts, Arts for Youth program. Through our unique activities such as the Greenopolis Kiosk and the Aluminum Show Study Guide, we hope to add an additional educational aspect to an already visually stunning innovation on the stage. Recycling education always comes first here at Waste Management, and we encourage everyone to recycle not just here at the Lancaster Performing Arts Center, but everywhere in the city of Lancaster, in their homes and throughout their daily lives. Thank you. Thank you, Julianne, and thank you to Waste Management for agreeing to participate and support our Arts for Youth program in an ongoing way. The Aluminum Show is a spectacular show, as you saw by the video, and the community is going to be delighted when they see it. If you love Blue Man Troop, this is Blue Man Troop Exponential times 10, and it's all recycled, and it's a phenomenal performance and a show, so we'll be delighted to have it here. Um, LPAC is pr proud to support our local educators, and I'm most proud that as part of being able to bring the performance performance here, we're also going to be able to add an additional performance to our Arts for Youth program. This year we have 
universally almost sold out every Arts for Youth performance that we had for our educators and for our school groups during the day. So we will have one added to the roster at 11 a.m. Um, for the students. Each performance within our Arts for Youth program offers study guides. Julianne hinted to that. For this show, for special for the aluminum show, the Waste Management ThinkGreen.com website will be hosting our study guide and assisting educators in engaging the students in not only recycling, but in arts education in our community. So the Arts for Youth program with support for companies like Waste Management has and continues to open up the classroom and our arts educators to the creative and imaginative process here in our Antelope Valley. So thank you very much. So we're really excited about this show. Thank you all for coming out today, and we hope to see you on either the 15th or the 16th of March.